Hey everybody, it's the centipede. Let me adjust things really quick. I know I haven't done one of these in a long while, and I know that I've already done System Shock 1. Not nearly as well as the professionals, but hey, I'm just an engineer who does nonsensical stuff on the side. With everything that's been going on, I've decided to play System Shock 1 again. I just completed the science level here, as you can see. Um, the next step is to take Isotope X-22 that I've picked up into the shield generator on the reactor level. This game's a nice warm wooby to me. Even if it is about a mad AI on a space station around Saturn, all built by a dystopic cyberpunk megacorporation. That being said, with, um, well, with Trump's new cabinet, it looks like we're on our way to that cyberpunk dystopia, so... <sighs> well, I mean, it's a lame one, isn't it? Rather than hackers fighting the man, they're subverting democracy and spreading lies about pedophile rings and pizza parlors. Wow, that was stupid of me. Uh, we live in a world where Russian tweet bots are actual things, and distributed denial of service attacks operate off of botnets based off of internet connected dildos. A dog whistling idiot without even the ideological rigor to call him a fascist has been elected president. The foreign minister of Russia has straight up admitted daily contact with his and only his election campaign. The EPA is going to be run by a climate denier and the Department of Education is going to be run by a lady who not only hates the concept of public schools but that child labor, yes, child labor is grand. It's an opportunity for them to learn and excel. So you know what? Fuck it. Hail Shodan. Thank you. You have saved us all some effort by destroying the greater part of Earth's civilization yourself. Please wait where you are, and a Cortex Reaver will arrive shortly to escort you to the celebration. Faulty civilization is right. Oh, it doesn't even give me the, co the Cortex Reaver ending? Oh. Oh, oh well. Still, it made me feel a little better. Also, um, the one bright spot of this entire quarter, last quarter of the year has been that Terry Brosius, the voice actress behind Shodan here, um, called me an insect on Twitter. So, gotta take your uh, victories where you can find them. This has been a cent the centipede. I don't know if I'll ever do any of these things again. Uh, I might, might not. Probably not. Not really my thing. Other people do it better. Anyway, you all have a better one, and... I don't know. Try not to die.